This is like the Nutri Bullet, but way more aesthetic. This is so good. I got a bunch of cherries, two pounds. Like, am I dumb and just watching my popcorn bag just sit under a light right now? sing for the life of me. This isn't straight. Just like a lot of you watching. This sunlight? Bro, like are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god. Did y'all see the sunrise this morning? Of course you did. I just recorded that for you. East and the west, racking up on my breath. Uh, power on me. I'm feeling just like a Tesla. Too much tree. The smoke is making my chest hurt. Girl on me. I'm thinking I should arrest her. Hey. I'm thinking I should have rest all night long. She put me to the test. Got a lot. This morning I woke up and it was so cold. I don't know if like my heat in my house works or not. Um, I was out here literally just like pressing, bippo bopping. I'm like out here just doing this for like 30 minutes straight, trying to figure it out. I'm dying right now. Like so badly dying. I'm only on this for 18 minutes. And I'm like pushed through my but there's a grandma over there running. Like out of shape am I is my question. 12, 3, 30, more like 10, 2.5, 18, like, I cannot do this. Okay, I just got back from sweating my ass off, even though I didn't even complete 12, 3, 30, like, that's the funny thing. I'm like, oh my god, I want to do it twice a day and I can't even complete it once, but it's okay. We went, I just have to go to an appointment real quick though, down in Brooklyn, so I'm gonna go do that. But, oh my god, the grandma in there? I can't say the grandma, but the old Asian lady was jogging and like I want to be that when I'm older You know what I mean? But like I can't even do that now when I'm 19. That's lame. That's pathetic And I cannot believe that I used to do 12 3 30 after a full leg workout I did like kind of a half leg workout today. I just like didn't realize that I should probably shave my armpits. Like I don't care about the hair that's there because I haven't shaved in like two months. I know so many new people are watching right now and it kind of scares me that y'all are just like seeing me in the raw. Ugh, time to be a fit bitch, guys. I like used to be a fit bitch. Y'all saw me, I was on my grind and then now I'm not. So we're going through this together. But the lighting is actually insane. The sunrise, the view when I work out is also insane. Like everything is just insane. I almost forgot to put this back. I'm trying to put things back and like clean as I go instead of just making a mess as I have a mess. But you know what I mean? Stay kind of organized. Downstairs just called me and said that I have a bunch more packages. So let's go pick those up. I just ordered coffee because I'm so tired. It's because I woke up at 6 a.m., which is 3 a.m. LA time. I literally just want to like sleep. But the whole point of today was to go grocery shopping and I literally haven't even thought about that yet. I don't have furniture. That's also a thought that I have. I know. Thank you. Wow, we love a gentleman. God damn. Tell me how I just took this 65 inch TV up all by myself. I was literally in the hallway acting like it was like one of those like machines, you know, that football players use. And I was going, running and running and running. <laughs> well, I just ordered Joe and the Juice, it got here. Oh, Joe and the Juice, it got here. The fact that I just ripped the bag open for easy access instead of pulling it out. Like that's how lazy I am. I got a iced coffee with almond milk and also a juice with carrot, apple, ginger, and then I added turmeric, which was like boba and I could just, I talk about boba too much. Like that's the reason why my face is breaking out. Hated that. This is amazing. It has ginger in it too. Did I say that? Who thought drinking carrots would be crack? This is the grocery shopping fit. I definitely think it could be cuter like if I wore a different undershirt, but this is the warmest thing I have. It's like this green Sherpa from My Mom Made It. It like kind of matches, but like it's just too much, but it's gonna keep me warm since I have to do a lot of grocery shopping. Um, but then this jacket I got from the Melrose Trading Post, not the Trading Post, but on Melrose in LA, thrifted it. And then these are Kanye sweatpants. And then my shoes are just some Nike Jordans. Oh my God, okay, 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 bitch, okay, bitch. Okay, bitch, I get it, you're coming. He's hopping like that doodle jump game. You know how like you used to play that app and it's like you doodle jump, that was him. <sighs> okay, currently on Canal Street because 
I love to get groceries here. I'll leave a documentary down below about all these food carts and stuff like that because they're always super fresh because they have to wake up like super early in the morning to get them off the trucks. So they're a lot more fresh than like the grocery stores and stuff like that, but you had to get cash for it. Just one, yeah, just one. I'm so warm, but I look like an old white dad. I just got strawberries, blueberries, sweet potatoes, and cherries for $14. I just bought salmon, but I'm gonna put it all in my backpack. Next time I come here, I'm gonna bring reusable bags. We got a lot of stops to make, but I love this place. Oh my God, it just hit me that I am so hungry right now. I'm not supposed to be eating out, but since I'm on the process of buying my groceries, this is actually gonna be the last time that I'm eating out in a while, and I'm actually being serious so you know what that means period the truck knows what that means but hi just a one to but hi yeah i'm gonna yeah we're not a, yeah come on yeah how do you yeah come on i was literally just here like 15 minutes ago because i had to use the bathroom and i knew that we were homies and they let me use the bathroom but i'm so hungry come on no no for you. That shit actually took maybe two minutes. I walked in, ordered, and boom. I sat down for maybe two minutes, and the food is here. Ooh. Y'all have seen me here way too many times. Actually, I've vlogged a couple times and never posted it. I've been here a lot. I feel like this place just has the most flavor. If y'all live in New York or ever come to New York and want some good Vietnamese food, first of all, if you've never tried Vietnamese food, y'all gotta get on it. It's like my favorite food. Then Italian, then Mexican. Mmm, so good. And I will never get sick of it. But come to uh, Natran 1, and if you do, let them know that I sent you. So good. Before I moved here, y'all heard me talk about how much I love Chinatown and how like I would love to just go to Chinatown all the time and how it makes me feel like at home. And now we're here. My eyes are watering. That shit's so hot, but so good. Two seconds later. I eat that shit in literally like five minutes. Who's FaceTiming me? I don't know this phone number and they're FaceTiming me. I just got more groceries. I just freaking strapped my bag to my backpack so that I don't even have to carry it. I do have to be careful though, but it's effective, not cute. Not cute at all, but effective. What does she eat? <laughs> you see, the white one looks the best quality, but the colorful ones are so cute. I'm trying to find a rice cooker right now. Oh my god, I have a pink rice cooker. So cute. Stealing. Yeah. Yeah. He swats the cat. Cat. Dog. Okay, so I was supposed to only get a couple things, but I ended up buying a fucking rice cooker and like so many other things. So I'm gonna get a taxi home because this is a hefty like 30 pounds to walk 20 minutes. Usually I'm okay with walking, but like I have a backpack and these. We're gonna go home, drop these off, and then keep going grocery shopping. The guy was so nice. He started asking about Sterling and started petting him, and he was like obsessed with Sterling and then asked him like what food he ate, like the most random questions. But he, we couldn't understand each other, so we just used Google Translate and he helped me bag my items and stuff. It was so cute. Anyways. I'm gonna put everything in the fridge that needs to be refrigerated and then we're gonna head to Target because I need to go get Sterling. I need to go get a couple other things. What I'm gonna be doing on Valentine's Day is I'm gonna be buying these for myself. That's okay, we're gonna have like a little party, okay? Me and you, I'm gonna literally be alone for Valentine's Day, like no joke. So I think I'm gonna film a YouTube video of me doing Valentine's Day alone because I'm taking myself on a date and getting ready for myself because I don't have a boyfriend and I'm not complaining. It's just, I'm not even saying Valentine's Day because if I had a boyfriend, I would love it, you know? So just this year, we're gonna be celebrating it alone, like usual. I'm currently at this place. I don't know what it's called, I'll check later, but I'm just gonna get some things just because it's an actual grocery store and I feel like Target and Trader Joe's is very like selective and catered to a certain thing, you know? So I just wanted to go in a regular one. Ooh, we're gonna get the expensive butter, guys. I usually buy like 10 cans of beans, but we only need one. Raspberry jam is superior. I've said it so many times. This is truly the biggest Trader Joe's I've ever been in in my life. Ms. Girl's exhausted. My back hurts. 
But did I save $15 on an Uber ride? Yes. I can't wait till like, I get shit organized because right now everything is everywhere. Oh, why are my yiddies sore? I just know my back is about to crack. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, what? Okay. Wasn't as crunchy as I thought, though. Oh, a little more. We got a little more. Okay. Nothing? You're good. Oh, there we go. We got, we got one crack. Oh my god, I love how this kitchen just. It, this is perfect and the fact that like I can just zoom it out and y'all can see literally everything happening here Like can y'all imagine the cooking videos? How does it work if it's not spinning like is it gonna work or am I just like watching a fucking popcorn bag Which is a light right now, you know, like am I dumb and just watching my popcorn bag just sit under a light right now Because I feel like that's what's happening. I don't think it's doing anything Oh my fuck God, I was just watching it under a light. What the f is this popcorn sitting for? Oh, I, I got it. it. It definitely is supposed to make a sound. Look, y'all. It's pussy pop it. Wow, it doesn't smell like butter. That's how you know that it's like the healthy popcorn. You know what I learned? Random fact. You know popcorn's done when it doesn't pop. Every like you wait, you count for three seconds, and if it doesn't pop, then it's done. Mm. I'm melting my butter right now. Did your parents ever tell you if you sit too close to the microwave, you're gonna get cancer because the radiation? Cause same. I feel like I'm at the movie theater right now getting like the kids, um, the kids popcorn option, you know? All we're missing is like M&M. Today, I'm going to be doing a lot of kitchen organizing. That's kind of the main purpose of waking up today was to organize my kitchen or else I don't even know if I would have gotten up. Time is currently, I think, like around 10 a.m. I am hungry though, but I'm like, should I do some like fasted cardio? I feel like, that could be the move. But first, oh, but I kind of want bread. I really do want bread. Should we go get some fresh bread from the market? Not the market. What am I doing? Acting like it's like the 19th century. Like the market. Let's go pick up some bread from a French bakery. French, French bakery. Walk Sterling so we can go piss. Then we're gonna go to the gym. Are you ready, sir, sir? Me and my little white dog. Do we not look prissy as fuck? You're telling me you don't have oat milk for my iced latte? You only have soy? Can I speak to the manager? Plate, so we're just gonna use this cutting board. Cheers. It's like eggs, toast, and like arugula. What do you expect, you know? I feel like it's missing something. I definitely need to add feta. This will add like this saltiness to it. I add feta to absolutely everything, bro. If something's lacking, you just need to add feta. Yo, I love cooking in this house. I already love cooking regardless, y'all know this. But just filming cooking in this house makes it 10 times easier and just the lighting and everything, oh my God. In the back there, I don't want like have to hunch my back to cook because in my last house, I didn't even have a kitchen like island. It was like a dining room table. I made it work though, but this is so good. I always dreamed of going to get fresh bread and fresh fruit and vegetables from the market or just like from local shops. Cause like I saw this one TikTok and she did it and I was like, oh my God, this is my dream. And I remember seeing it literally last year in the summer being like, oh, I wish. And now I'm living it. Like I literally just walked this morning to get fresh bread. Insane. I literally have just been sitting here for the past 10 minutes looking out the window. Cause I'm like, what the f like I genuinely can't believe that like this is my apartment and like this is my life right now. When I signed this lease, I didn't I didn't know what the view was, you know? It was like a video walkthrough, but like I didn't know that this was the view. I didn't realize that I would be able to see every single building in New York from this view. I can see the Empire State Building. I can see that really one tall building that they just built. I can see parts of Times Square, like this is actually insane. Like the fact that I can see one, two, three four, five, six. I can see every single bridge is insane. And I can just see like all the like ships passing by and the water taxis. Thank you. <laughs> Stanley, come here. Ew, what the fuck? My coffee's dripping. Oh my God, no, 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 no. Not fucking cool, man. Bro, are you kidding me? It's okay. 
It's only a little inconvenience. It's easy, it's gonna be cleaned up. We don't need to make a big freaking deal out of it and let it ruin our energy. Oh my God, wow. I thought saying that was gonna kind of be a joke, but it actually made me feel so much better. Oh my God, look how cute this is. They put hearts on the coffee. Yesterday I got Joe and the juice, but today I thought I would try something different. I'm not a caffeine addict, but it's getting to the point where like I need it, which is not good. This tastes like ass. Maybe the hot coffee will taste better. But the fact that it tastes like ass means it's healthy for me, you know? Like there's not a bunch of added sugar. Oh my God. Tastes like ass. I'm not saying like it tastes like ass in a way where it's like the coffee is bad itself. It's just that like no sugar. Two hours later. Anyways, I've just been sitting here for the past like two, three hours just doing work. When I say work, it's just literally like editing a video or like watching YouTube videos to like get inspired. But I just moved like my mat out here. I don't need furniture. Like I'm happy like this, you know what I mean? Like why would I need a couch to sit on when I have this? It's the perfect height. I love like sitting on this little windowsill. I would be fine with no furniture and just like living life like this. This probably looks mad depressing, but Fine by me. Anyways, I have packages to go pick up. I still need to organize my kitchen, but let's go pick up the packages because they probably hate me because it probably takes up so much space. But the thing that's motivating me to get my packages is I think that my blender that I packed is gonna be in it. All right, let's go get packages. Those are all of my boxes. Like everything I need, I have now. Everything else that's gonna be coming in is like furniture and stuff now. So I thought we would organize my kitchen. So I think it has so much storage space and I wanna make use of all of this. I think I'm gonna need to get a step stool for all of this. I just like don't know why I would need this much space even though it's gonna make sense because of my last apartment I used up all the space for some goddamn reason. <laughs> I don't have any plates yet, I don't have my Tupperware, but it looks super good. I made some sweet potato with broccoli, chicken and brown rice. This is honestly probably gonna be one of my new favorite dinners. It's so simple too. I literally just buy like chicken that's already pre-cut. It's more expensive, but it's just convenient for me. And then I season it with simple shit. Olive oil, salt, pepper, oregano, thyme. Throw that stuff on a pan with olive oil, cook it. Mmm, so good. And then some sweet potato, new favorite thing. Mmm, this tastes bomb. Like I would buy this, you know? New house, new blender. I've been eyeing this for so long now. Just wait till you see this blender if you don't know what I'm talking about. Also, can you see my armpit hair? Oh my gosh! Look at how beautiful this thing looks. This is the first new thing that I have in here. Okay, okay, period. Oh my gosh. Okay, the blender. Wow, and look at this mini blender. Oh my God, and I could just like use this as a cup too. So it's like, you go like this, you tap this on, and then when you're ready to blend, you just turn it over and you snap it in. <gasps> this is like the Nutribullet, but way more aesthetic and probably doesn't break that easy. This is a lot more heavy duty, like this is heavy. This is a portable drinking lid. So like you put this on and you can drink out of this. Okay, period. Oh my God, and then this is like for storage, y'all. And then if I wanna make like big smoothies, or like if I'm cooking and something calls to be blended, super easy. But this, this is Fine, like do we see this? Oh my gosh, how freaking cute. And I got this hydration system too. This is amazing. So basically, if I want infused water or like let's say I wanna make like some sort of like cold tea, put the tea in here or whatever I wanna infuse it with, put it in here, boom, you're making infused water. Cap this shit up, oh my God. This is like actually so exciting. I cannot wait to make smoothies. I made the biggest mess, but I think tomorrow I'm gonna clean, go to the gym and just kind of chill, like nothing big to do or anything. Just chill, cause like I have so much time, you know? No plan on getting furniture. And I know y'all are probably like, my, what the heck? But I don't know, I feel like taking it one step at a time is really nice, you know? Like how I can just dedicate a day to just doing one thing. And I feel like furniture is just too much stress for me right now. So I'm just kind of slowly unboxing things, I guess. This is what the fridge looks like though. Very simple. It's not as extravagant as my fridge tours. You 
usually are, but it's because like I don't need that much food, you know? <laughs> this is one of the cupboards. I just have like all of my avocados, potatoes, everything in there. Um, this is super cool though. It like spins. In here, just my rice, bread, rice cakes, popcorn. I left my bananas out because I don't want them to brown too quick. Up here is my toaster and my kettle. Whenever I need it, I just want to grab it. I don't want them out on the counter, but I did leave this out on the counter though because I like how pretty it looks. So down here, I'm super satisfied with this. Cutting boards, all that stuff. I really love these organizers. It's gonna pain me how dirty these get, but I need a super glue them back on because they broke. They were broken before, but here are all the spices and stuff that I use a bunch. And then here's the stuff that I don't, that's what I mean. They just fucking break. Here's the stuff that I don't use as often. But that is it for today's video. I'm so exhausted and pooped. I'll see you guys tomorrow though. Make sure to subscribe to be part of the family and follow my Instagram, specifically my spam account if you want to get some juicy tea. But if you figure that you don't like me later, you can always unsubscribe, but just subscribe now, please. I would I actually love you forever, but I love you regardless. Comment anything down below. Let me know if you're enjoying these series. The more you let me know, the more I'll vlog, you know? But I'll see you tomorrow. I'm so tired. Bye.